Hello Clashers and Clashettes, and welcome to the Clash Royale North American Open recap of Coronation number 14. Today, we are following our two finalists, Dark Force and Odyssey. Dark Force faces Mr. B-Boy 06 in the first match of the day and wins game one with a great Lava Hound minor push. However, through admin decision, Mr. B-Boy is dropped out of the tournament, earning Dark Force a semi-final spot to face off against Yusuf. Meanwhile, Odyssey defeats Bassam 2-1 and faces Fediwap, a multiple-time returning top 8 competitor, on the other side of the bracket. Dark Force starts out again with a Lava Hound deck and, once again, with great use of Elixir, is able to take down the 9-cost 3 Musketeers with a Fireball and Zap, earning a fantastic victory. Dark Force moves on to the finals with a 2-1 score. Odyssey faces off in an intense match with Fediwap, but wins the match 2-1 closing it out with a great double Lava Hound, double Inferno Dragon play. The Inferno Dragon burns the tower down for the killing blow, launching Odyssey into the finals to face off against Dark Force. Dark Force is fielding a minor Inferno Cycle deck and a Lava Hound minor deck, while Odyssey is using a Lava Hound Inferno Dragon deck and a Bowler Inferno Graveyard deck. Odyssey takes the first game of the match, putting the score line 1-0. Dark Force fights back, taking the second game with another well-placed Lava Hound minor combo. Mega Minion and Lava Pups destroy Odyssey's tower and puts the scoreline to 1-1. Dark Force goes on to win another game leading 2-1, but coming back from the brink of defeat, Odyssey uses a well-timed Graveyard Fireball to instantly eliminate the defensive skeleton army of Dark Force to win and tie the match 2-2. Odyssey finally pushes past the Iron Wall of Defense that Dark Force set up with his minor Inferno deck and closes out the match with a final lightning drop, earning him the Coronation Crown. Thank you all for watching the Coronation Day 14 recap. Make sure you tune in Wednesday, November 16th at 6 o'clock p.m. Pacific Standard Time, where a new champion will be crowned.